Hey gang, David Sparks here from The Automators. This is a screencast arising from episode two about automating email. I'm gonna show you something cool, but you can download it if you want from maxsparky.com or automators.fm. Text Expander is one of the easiest ways to start automating email, especially on your Mac, but it's still powerful. So I wanted to show you this one. This is what I would call an advanced text expander snippet for sending email. Uh, if you look here on the left side of the screen, I've got the snippet I've built, and it's a snippet I would send with a monthly uh, invoice. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go in the subject line and type the text expander snippet, which is N-E-W-I-N-V, and then it's gonna fill in the name of the company, and then this little code, percentage sign B, that actually inserts the current month. To create that code, you just put the cursor anywhere in your snippet, and then you go, click that button and then say month and then it creates the snippet for you. Oops. There we go. Uh, percentage sign B. You can do other types of date snippets as well, but this is what I want for this one. Then I've got another snippet I used from the keyboard section that puts in the tab key. Tab key is important when you're sending an email because you can trigger the snippet in the subject line and the tab key will jump it to the body line to continue. Then it says hi, and it has a basic fill-in field where I can fill in the name of the recipient. I'm going to do a separate screencast with a cool Apple script that allows you to actually pull the name of the recipient from the sender field. And then it fills in the body of the email, and then I've got a bunch of um, selection snippets in there that you can pick from. And, oops, there's the one I put it for the date cut. Uh, so you can go ahead and select a certain text to be included in the email and other text not to be included. So let's see the whole thing in action. I'm gonna go over here to this email. I'm gonna type in the code N-E-W-I-N-V and that triggers the snippet. So you can see there it is. It's got the name of the company, the current month, hi, Rosemary. And then you can go through and select text to include. I'll say go ahead and let me know if you'd like hard copies, but I'll leave the other one unchecked. And if I want to, I can have some fun with it and say, you need to do a better job watering the grass. Whoops. Ever notice when I make screencasts, I completely lose my ability to type. All right, there we go. So I added some additional text to the note. Click OK, and you can see it just ran. So first it filled in the subject field with the current month, then it hit the tab key and created the rest of the snippet pursuant to my instruction. All I have to do then is hit the send key, I can tap send, or if I'm a true automator, I'm gonna hold down the Command-Shift-D keys, and off it goes.